Hello and welcome to this plan with me video in my B6 planner. This is a print pression planner and I'm using a kit by the planning diary. The lovely Yvonne gave me this kit and wow, I wasn't really sure yet at first if I really like this kit because the colors are a bit less glammy than I like them. And, you know, a body positivity kit was not immediately the first thing that I would think to put in my planner. I have to confess, I am obsessed. As I told Yvonne in some voice memos, I am just loving how everything got together. The colors are magnificent. The full boxes just really sing. And I feel this is one of my cuter spreads in this planner. So that is saying something. I started by putting down the bottom washi and now I'm just putting down the date covers. And I think then I will be putting down the full boxes. There were tons of full boxes to choose from, especially with the different fashion girls. And I was almost spoiled for choice because in a B6, you cannot really fit one full box per day. I did in the end, actually, because I thought they were just so cute. Um, but I still had two. Yeah, I still had two left that I'm going to use in future spreads or will be putting in my reusable sticker album for using in any leftover spread in the future. But I think I want to try to do another spread with all the stickers I have left over from this kit actually. So more on that later. As always, I'm cutting apart the different full boxes so I can move them around a bit easily as you can see me doing here all over the pages. I always like to try and get all the different colors you know, uh, spread out over the spread. So not a red full box next to a red full box. Also not like a outdoor scene next to another outdoor scene. The fashion girls not together. And then as always as well, I did the sort of up down, up down method. The Friday, no, the Saturday and Sunday are super full. I basically do not have any space to write. I want to put a sticker over the box on Saturday and the Sunday box is actually one where you can write on. That was already designed by Yvonne, so that is super useful. And on the other days, I did my up, down, up, down method, um, starting from the Friday, actually, where I put the Radiate Positivity one sort of in the middle of the Saturday and the Sunday full boxes and the rest of them scattered all over the week. I did feel that the top area was a bit bland and a bit boring. So I put some Simply Gilded Washi there that matched perfectly. Love it. And that also gave me a lovely backdrop for the weekend banner. Checking before writing down the dates with a cute silver pen, because cute, um, to make sure that I did not write any wrong dates in. And then I got stuck in with all the stickers on the different days. So while I am working hard on my spread on the screen, let me not just tell you what I'm doing on screen, but tell you what I will be doing in the week of the 25th of April till the 1st of May. So on Wednesday is actually Koningsdag. It's the King's birthday, King's Day. So we have a official day off from work, from school, from everything. So that prompted me to decide to also take off the Monday and Tuesday from work. I still have quite a lot of hours left over. So I do need to finish some of them off this year. So I thought, might as well. So this Monday, I'm actually going to Germany for a few days. I'm hanging out with a friend and we're going to be crafting together. So both of us have some scrapbooking project that we just cannot seem to start with or finish or, you know, um, get a nice chunk of work done. So I'm going to visit her. I'm bringing all my craft supplies that I want to work on. She has her craft supplies at her home, of course. And then we'll have a large table all the snacks and music and chatting that we want to do. And it will be so fun to hang out with her, of course, get my project done, or at least, you know, get quite a lot of work done for my project and also have the chance to visit some German shops. And while it perhaps sounds a bit funny, I'm just so excited to visit a German supermarket and I'm looking forward to visiting the DM, which is a drugstore in Germany. And, you know, there's Talia, of course, there's TK Maxx, uh, Nanu Nana is one of my favorite shops in Germany and also Depot. And like, generally speaking, there's probably going to be, you know, um, nice sandwich shops that 
are probably very similar to the ones here, but they're in Germany. So the sandwiches are probably going to be tasting nicer. And I'm just really looking forward to probably not really enjoying the weather because it's not looking very nice. But, you know, not nice weather makes perfect weather for scrapbooking. So I am very excited to scrapbook, hang out with my friend, chill for a few days, not work, and then sort of refreshed, go back to Delft and get back to work. While I have been chatting away, the pages are almost filled. I have scattered all the half boxes and quarter boxes around different full boxes, added in some checklists on the days that I need to, you know, remember to do stuff. So for Friday, Saturday and Sunday, I'm not yet completely sure what I'll be doing. There are some things that I need to take care of, like returning some packages and taking out the trash. But other than that, I don't really have any plans. So I'm really happy that these tickets by the planning diary are actually printed on matte removable paper. So that will be super easy to lift up some stickers if needed without ripping the stickers or ripping the paper of the planner. So this is everything that I have left, quite a bit still, so that's why I think I am be able to use these stickers in another spread, in another planner perhaps, maybe in my Marsha planner. And then also I decided to already fill in some things and I was so excited that this pen, I got it at Sostenegrene, this pen actually matches the kit. So that was very exciting. And it also shows that, you know, the colors of this kit were just absolutely perfect for me because I have different stationery in these colors. So yeah, not sure why I was a bit hesitant at first. Anyway, speeding through the pages, I'm trying to write things down chronologically. Again, Monday to Thursday, I have a better sort of idea of what I will be doing. So it's slightly easier to fill everything out in there. For the rest of the week, I'm anticipating that I might need some white out, but that is fine, you know, whiting out a bit of writing and then maybe sticking over a sticker. I mean, I have more than enough stickers left is, of course, absolutely no issue. Other than that, I mainly used deco stickers from the kit, either in Yvonne's handwriting, obsessed, or some of the deco stickers, doodles and clip art. I did also pull in some extra stickers. Um, I really like the little cars to sort of show that we're driving to Germany. And also on Tuesday, I used two different sort of planner and crafty desk stickers. And here as well for Friday, I'm using a sticker to remind myself to pick up some packages. And that is it. The rest of the week I will fill in as we go along. And thanks for watching and see you next time in the next video. Bye bye.